Finally! They're home! Ah, They look really tired. I hope work wasn't too hard on them. Even if it was, I'm still so glad they're back. It's so lonely being stuck here all day. They may not be able to see me, but I really enjoy their company. Even if they don't actually know they're keeping me company. Hmm. I guess it's time for dinner. <sighs> I miss being able to eat. So many more delicious foods I had yet to try. I wonder what they'll make. Wait, is that a notepad on the counter? I wonder. Huh, hey! Hey, it worked! I, I actually picked it up! Uh, oh. Oh no. They look terrified. I, I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna slowly put it down. There, there it's down. Oh no. They still looked freaked out. What am I? W wait. You can see me? <laughs> you can. You can see me? This is. This is awesome! I don't know how this is working, but I'm so glad you can finally see me! Uh, what am I talking about? Hey? Hey? It's okay. You can put down the knife. I'm not gonna hurt you. Isn't it obvious? I'm a ghost. I've been living here with you for a while, so I really hope you don't mind. I've been staying in your spare room most of the time. I, I'll pay rent if you want me to. I mean, I, I don't have any money, but I could figure something out. J just... Please, please don't try and get rid of me. I'll do anything. <laughs> I'm really not making the situation any better, am I? I'm so sorry. If, if this makes you uncomfortable, then I can go. I'm just really glad someone finally saw me. It was really nice meeting you. Maybe I'll see you again sometime. You don't want me to go? R really? Oh, I will absolutely stay if you want me to. Wait, why would you want me to stay? All I've done since coming here is move things around and scare you. You want to get to know me? I mean, you can if you want to. I'm just... A little surprised, that's all. Great. Uh, where should I start? It's kind of been a while. Oh, right, my name. <laughs> my name's Daniel. I would ask you what yours is, but I kind of already know. How? Oh, well... I pay attention to the letters which get posted through the door. They all have the same name on it, and as you're kind of the only person who lives here, I guess that was your name. <laughs> Why did I choose your house to haunt? Well, I tend to go to different houses, because I typically don't like to stay in a warm place for too long. But your place was really different. I felt... Almost at home for the first time since, you know, the whole ghostification process. Ah. Well, I was involved in a car accident. There was a kitty cat sitting in the road and it wasn't getting out of the way. And then I saw a car coming. I couldn't help myself. I had to run into that road to save it. And I did it! I got it to safety. But I... I didn't get to safety. And since then, I've been like this. 
that's why you're so weird. Normally most people can't even tell I'm around, but you, you can finally see me. To be honest, I don't know why either, but I also don't care. I finally get to talk to you. That's what's important to me. You're the first person I've spoken to since being like this. Others like me? Oh, of course. There's a lot, actually. Some are nice and others not so nice. I haven't interacted with another ghost in a while, actually. I've been too busy here. What do I mean by not so nice ghost? Well, there's a few who are just mean. Some of them especially so to me. But it's okay. I can deal with them. <laughs> Don't be worried. I'm fine. I haven't even seen them for a while, so I guess they got bored messing with me. Anyway... How was work? You look absolutely exhausted. Aww, a rough day? Well, let me cheer you up. Hmm, what? What could I even do? Usually I would offer a hug, but since you're, you know, living, I doubt you'll be able to feel it. I mean, we can try, yes, but I don't even know if I can touch you, let alone hug you. Wait, you can feel it? Honestly, you're not joking, are you? It it's okay if you are, I don't mind. You... you promise? <laughs> I... I... I don't know what to say. I don't know what's happening or why it's happening. But I like it. <laughs> but I still look like a ghost, or do I look normal to you? Still a ghost, huh? Hmm. But does that mean anyone else can see me now? Strange. Oh, um, I'm not too sure about going outside. I don't want what happened last time to happen again. It's nothing. Forget I said anything. Anyways, I'm so, so happy you can see me. You're one of the nicest people I have ever met. I don't know if other people would be nice to me considering what I am. Am I going to stay here? Well, only if you want me to. I can find somewhere else if you need time to process this. You do want me to stay? Okay. I I promise to be more careful from now on, though. I'm really sorry for breaking your things. I'm just... really clumsy. Oh, you need to cook dinner? No, no, that's okay. I can go sit in the other room or something until you finish cooking. I don't want to get in your way. Oh, me? No, I... Don't want anything. I can't eat anything anyway because, you know, I think you've got the point. <laughs> I do really appreciate the offer though. I'm sure you're an amazing cook. In the meantime though, I've just got to take care of one thing. I promise I won't be long. And as soon as I'm back, I'll wait in the living room to see your amazing cooking. <laughs> Thank you so much. See you again soon, hun. Please, make sure you enjoy your meal. <laughs>